Hey, it's Cosmos Solutions 8, and uh, in this video, I want to show you how to use UTM parameters to customize your on-site content. Now, this is a little, this is a little off of Google, and it's been a long day, so I'm just making a quick one. I hope you'll forgive me. Um, this requires an application that allows you to do this, but in my experience, the majority of the um, more mainstream web applications make this accessible to you. So I'm using high level uh, in my example because I love them, um, but you should be able to do this with you know, click funnels. I, honestly, any landing page builder uh, would be my, my expectation. Uh, the vast majority of you know, the, the marketing automation tools, um, I believe HubSpot makes this accessible and quite a few others. So um, what I've done here is I've got uh, high level allows me to uh, insert uh, a tag for um, UTM parameters. So I've got my UTM keyword uh, here and then I've got, I added it somewhere else too because I wanted to see like multiple manifestations. And uh, when I go to my page, you'll notice that if I go to the corresponding section, I see nothing. I see nothing. And you're like, well, why do you see nothing? Because the stuff is there. There's a tag there. I should see it, but I don't see it. Something's wrong. Or is it? So I'm going to go, uh, there we go. Um, let's do go high level. So uh, UTM keyword equals go high level. And bam, look at that. All of a sudden, go high level. <sighs> go high level. Uh, and, and incidentally, if you're not familiar with it, you can set up the delivery on an account level. But the easy way to do this is inside of a campaign. Uh, is Google going to freeze on me? Go to settings, additional settings, uh, campaign URL options. And this is where we can deliver, you know, if I want to deliver UTM keyword. Uh, you can come up with the whole tracking script too, um, which is pretty cool. But um, so think about the implications here. When you're running ad campaigns, being contextually appropriate is so important because if I see something that you know happens in the ad and I want to see that reflected on the page, um, it's hard to run around creating new pages for every single ad. But if you have the ability to swap this out, then you now have, uh, you know, like for instance, I bid on PPC agency and Google Ads agency. Well, if you're, you know, searching for PPC agency, I might want to deliver a, a page that has adjusted to um, the naming conventions that you're used to. So, uh, really wicked ninja trick if um, you care to use it. Uh, I hope this is helpful. Thumbs up if you liked it. Comment if you have any ideas, questions, comments, concerns, confessions. Subscribe if you want to see me every single day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.